As the Ninth National Assembly marks two years since its inauguration, the Senate says it has so far passed a total of 58 bills out of the 742 bills introduced. President of the Senate, Ahmed Lawan, made this known on Wednesday at a special session to mark the second anniversary of the Ninth Senate. The primary responsibility of Parliament is to make laws for the good governance of that country. That is also the priority of our agenda. The Senate passed hundreds of bills, legislations, including confirmation of appointments for executive arm of government. About 742 bills were introduced during the two sessions of the Assembly, of which 58 have been passed. 355 bills have gone through first reading, 175 bills have gone through second reading and have been referred to the relevant committees for further legislative business, while 11 bills referred by the House of Representatives for concurrence have also been passed. The bills cut across all the sectors and touch on most areas of needs in the lives of our citizens. The economy, as I've said earlier, we agreed in our agenda to focus on some key areas including the economy. One of our most significant interventions in this sector is the restoration of the national annual budget to the January to December cycle. Lawan promised that the controversial petroleum industry bill will be passed before the end of June after about 20 years of failed attempts. The Senate President said that the Senate would consider the report of its committee on the amendment of the 1999 Constitution before embarking on 2021 summer break in July. On the PIB, we promised to break the jinx on the petroleum industry bill and we are on the verge of doing this by, the, by finally passing the bill sometimes this month of June, something that has defied passage for over 20 years. On the security challenges, we are currently pushing our country to the edge to ensure security challenges are currently pushing our country to the edge of the precipice, insurgency, banditry, kidnapping, and attacks on public facilities are occurring daily in many parts of the country with our security forces stretched almost to their elastic limit. To address the emergency, we passed several resolutions as part of our legislative interventions and kept engaging with the executive in order to achieve the desired outcome. In this respect, our committee on the Constitution Review, having done the public hearings across the six geopolitical zones and also holding the national public hearing, is working assiduously on putting the report for this Senate to consider. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.